Hello folks, it is the 17th of March 2017 and we have some breaking news. Now Donald Trump's tax returns from 2005 were leaked on television this week. Now this was illegal. They got his private tax returns, tax returns which showed that Donald Trump paid $30 million in tax. $30 million. Do you remember Clinton? Clinton said he paid $0 in tax but these tax returns say otherwise. They say he paid over $30 million. But that's not the point, folks. The point is, Donald Trump is angry about this, and he has got his private legal team to start making a case against MSNBC and the reporter. Now, this could be big. This could be a key moment in the fight against fake news. Donald Trump could shut down, could shut down these fake news sites now, it was interesting that this hit piece by MSNBC showed that President Donald Trump paid millions in taxes. He paid a higher tax rate than Obama and Bernie Sanders. But what's more, quote, disclosing a taxpayer's information without their consent is illegal. Now, Donald Trump's private legal team is weighing up a case, a case against MSNBC, who showed these documents, Donald Trump's private tax returns on national television. Now I'm going to play you a clip here. Comment below and tell us what you think. President Trump saying the leak of his taxes are illegal, but is he considering legal action to Charlie Gasparino with the latest details? Charlie. Uh, this is what sources close to the Trump, uh, Trump private lawyers, we should point out, different than the, the White House, are telling my uh, producer Brian Schwartz, Trump's private legal team, they are weighing a case against MSNBC and the journalist that first obtained this, David K. Johnson, longtime investigative reporters focused on Trump and taxes. He's a big time uh, Pulitzer Prize winner who did a lot of work on taxes, but they are, but the legal team is weighing a case against both of those ent entities for the publication of the 2005 tax returns. Uh, they're looking at violations of federal privacy law for that broadcast. Remember, it was on Tuesday on the Rachel Maddow show, where Rachel Maddow showed the two pages, right. the 1040s, and he, she brought on David K. Johnson, whose dcreport.org website aired it simultaneously. He's the one who, uh, who obtained the documents. Now, here's the interesting thing. As you, as you, you can tell from that, that uh, clip, Trump is obviously, uh, you know, hinting oh, that sure. he thinks this, sure. is, this is illegal. He, he's, it's, he said it's done in the past. The Times released a portion, I think, of a, of a state tax return uh, earlier in the campaign, which showed he took a massive loss on some on some properties. This one showed quite the opposite, that he made a lot of money. That's where the speculation came from, that he didn't pay taxes because he had to carry right. forward. He had to carry forward. Years. But this one showed that he did pay substantial taxes. It was 2005 and made a lot of money. So people doubted that he was really rich found out he made $153 million in 2005. Be that as it may, what we're hearing from the Trump camp is that he is really angry. He thinks it's a violation of law. Now, here's the rub, Charles. Um